And documents show authorities searching the Minneapolis apartment where Amir Locke was killed by a SWAT team member said they believed a no-knock search warrant was necessary to protect the public and officers investigating a violent homicide. The applications for the search warrants carried out at the apartment complex on February 2nd were made public on redacted forms Thursday. In them, police said it was necessary to conduct the searches unannounced because the suspect had a history of violence. Locke was not named in the warrants. The police killing of Locke, a 22-year-old black man, has sparked a re-examination of the use of no-knock warrants and calls for a statewide ban.